Thanks for rolling up. To my body is certified pilot. Um, finishing one of my uh, what did I do? At the new split, getting ready to twist up this Dutch Irish fusion shit. Man, this blunt ugly as fuck, bruh. It's an ugly blunt toe up and shit. We're gonna make it work. Let's jump, let's jump into the video, bruh. We got a laundry mat. <coughs> laundry room. <laughs> this cop body cam footage That's what it looks like It looks like it's Like it's body cam footage and shit All these houses back here look like It's probably an apartment Apartment complex or some shit maybe 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 even a hotel or some type of resort or some shit um mm. so we got what two black dudes and a mexican or is that three black dudes And light skinned dude right there, like, yeah, that's not that's not a white boy. I was about to say that could be a white boy, but no, nah, that's that's definitely a mixed nigga. Like, it could be a mixed nigga. I think he might be a Mexican. So, no, no that's a nigga. What apartment is that? What's the apartment number? Right here. You don't know it off your head, man? No, I don't know off my head. I don't know right now. What's it, what he said we're doing with her? What apartment is that? What's the apartment number? Right here. So I don't understand what they doing. I mean, he just asked the nigga where the, uh... Which apartment he in? Dude just stepped off. Like, I don't know. What the hell are you talking about, my dude? You don't know it off your head, man? No, I don't know off my head. I right well, I don't care about the weed. Y'all live here? He oh, lives here? Business. Business? Alright, so then what's the issue? If you don't know I mean the weed ain't the issue, where they at? Alright, so 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 what they ain't allowed they ain't allowed to visit a nigga? Like why why are you all up in their business? Alright man, well I'm security so you ain't going to jail or nothing. You just can't be smoking in here. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so that's the only issue. The only issue was that they were smoking in the laundry room. Oh you know what? Let's let's do it, bro. Why why was they smoking in there, bro? Why was they smoking in there? Like there there was like All right, so your niggas is waiting on all your clothes and shit. All right, all right, I can, I can, I can get that. But yeah, your niggas could step right out by the door, bro. It's not. He said, he said it wasn't a big deal. That y'all must be somewhere recreational and smooth. Hey man, you just can't smoke in here. You gotta go find somewhere else to smoke. All right. And, and don't ride these in here next time, all right? Appreciate it. That was like, that was a kind of smooth interaction, bro. Like, you know what I mean? It wasn't, what, didn't shit go down, you know what I mean, crazy? 
that's how like that's how like all interactions with now I mean uh enforcement should be. Y'all y'all niggas can't smoke in here. Go ahead, now I mean that way. Go 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 smoke, now I mean somewhere else. Loud ass four wheelers. This is loud as fuck, bro. Like, come on, bro. That shit was just loud for for no fucking reason. Loud for no fucking reason at all, bro. But you know what I mean that was that was that was a decent smooth little interaction. And I mean the dude the dude if he wanted to, I guess he could have called police since they was they looked like they was underage, even if there is now I'm saying somewhere recreation. But he didn't, bro. He said, I mean just go go do your thing somewhere else, bro. That's that was dope, bro. Yeah, I, I liked it that bro. That that's how that's how police interactions with weed smokers should be, bro. Simple and cordial, bro. <laughs>